Hello, welcome back to another Gateway Flipped Classroom video. In Unit 4 of the student's book, you heard four people making predictions about food in 2050. One of them predicts that we'll be using 3D printers to create our food in 2050. That's because they think that by 2050, 3D printers will have become a part of everyday life. The first sentence is in the future continuous. We use the future continuous to talk about activities in progress at a particular time in the future. The second sentence is in the future perfect. We use the future perfect to talk about activities that will be finished before a particular time in the future. We often use the preposition by with the future perfect. It means sometime before. So if you say, I'll have done my homework by 7 p.m., it means sometime before 7. To make the future continuous, we use will or won't plus be plus the ing form of the main verb. To make the future perfect, we use will or won't, plus have, plus the past participle of the main verb. Let's have a look at four more predictions about food in the future. Is each one future continuous or future perfect? That's right. Sentences 1 and 4 are future perfect. Sentences 2 and 3 are future continuous. You know, they say that seaweed might be the food of the future. It's very healthy and very tasty. You probably know that it's already been very popular for a long time in Asian countries such as Japan, Korea and China. But did you know that you probably eat more seaweed than you think? Why? Because it's sometimes added to ice cream to make it smooth and creamy. Mmm, looks delicious, but perhaps not the healthiest way to eat seaweed. Thanks for watching.